Hey, I'm Michael B2 Lighting Effects. Got a question for you. Can you use a microphone cable in place of a DMX cable? Or can you use a DMX cable in place of a microphone cable? Well, the answer to that is yes, you can. But no, you shouldn't do that. <laughs> that made a lot of sense, didn't it? Now, you can use a microphone cable in a pinch if you've only got a couple DMX lights going on. However, you can get some bad signals going to your DMX lights. Why? There's actually less shielding in the microphone cable than there is on the DMX cable. You would think it'd be the other way around because you're talking audio on the microphone cable, but that's not true. Plus, the impedance, the ohm impedance is different between the DMX cable and the microphone cable. The microphone cable has an 80 ohm impedance. The DMX cable has 120 ohm impedance. So there's a big difference. Uh, now, when you get the really long lengths of lights, you can get these. I get these in 50 feet, 100 feet. We got 25 feet, 10 feet, 5 feet, 3 feet. Look at this. One foot. And there's even two foot cables. The one foots are really nice. If you've got a lot of lights up on your truss, and you just want to link them together with little short runs. Uh, or if you got a little farther, you go with the two footers. My favorite are the Pro X. That's why I'm showing you the Pro X. Yeah, this is from AccuCable. Great cable. This is from Chevet Lighting or Chevet DJ. Great cable. But you get more for your money from the Pro X, and it is a true DMX cable. You're not going to lose signals with your lights or anything like that. So save a few bucks, go with the Pro X, and they got them in all kinds of lengths. A lot more lengths than Accu Cable or Chevet has. I like these. Where is it? The one footer for doing those real close lights or the two footer. Actually, the most popular is a three foot because you got a lot of variants to play with with the three footer. Anyway, there it is. Pro X. Now, real quick. If you've got a lot of lights and you're using DMX cables, not microphone cables, and you've got some lights flickering towards the end of the chain, and you're going, oh man, I got some broken lights, or I got some cheap cable. No, that's not the problem. All you need is this little guy right here. This is called the Schwarzenegger, no, <laughs> the Schwarzenegger Terminator. No, this is called the Terminator. And what does the Terminator do? Exactly what it says. It stops all signals from going any farther, duh, because it can't go past this, and it keeps them from bouncing backwards. That's more important. So, if you're doing a lot of lengths of cables, go with the Terminator. Be sure to get one of those. They're very inexpensive, under under ten dollars. They come in all different brands, that kind of stuff. But if you like, if you're like me and you want to do the job right, go with DMX for your DMX lights, and go with the Pro X and save yourself some money.